Good afternoon, YouTube. Today is August 15, 2020. I want to make a video, um, you know, my experience with the with the Holy Spirit. And um, yeah, I just want to get straight into the video. Um, I know your time is valuable. So uh, before that, let's start off with a prayer. Sovereign God, God of Israel, I pray this prayer, Lord, in, um, in the name of your son, Jesus, and that Jesus, you may, um, you know, bless anyone watching this video give me the words or just to you know to you know say my experience lord my testimony lord um with your holy spirit lord and um and yes lord just you know give an ear to our supplications may you fulfill all of our petitions lord all the requests of those who are watching this video lord whatever personal request that they have lord may you um you fulfill their petitions lord may you answer them in lord speedily lord and come to our aid lord especially right now in these times lord that we're living in um with everything that's going on lord and we pray this prayer in jesus name amen okay so um yes yeah, so i'm gonna get into this uh my experience my personal own experience with the holy spirit um you know i want to make this very clear my visions that i share on here uh they are true um you know, nothing on this channel is fabricated. Uh, nothing is just for entertainment purposes. This is, you know, real testimony, real things that I have, you know, encountered in my life and everything, you know. Um, and when, I, when I'm speaking, you know, of something, you know, I'm speaking in a, in a literal sense, you know, of visions, you know. Um, and, you know, I don't want anyone to change my words, you know. And say that I'm speaking figuratively or, you know, no. When I say that I'm, you know, I've had an encounter or I say that I've had a vision, I'm speaking in the literal sense. Um, you know, unless unless I personally state otherwise. Um, but yes, I hope that this is, you know, um, encouraging to someone. My experience with the Holy Spirit, I hope that this, you know, moves somebody and, you know, that this, that it's, it's you know, it, God's word is real. God's word is true. And, um, and, you know, if you are persistent, if you are, you know, continue to seek God, he will reveal himself to you and you will have, you know, those experiences, um, you know, God will make himself known to you if you are sincere, if you are, you know, seeking him. Okay. Um, but anyway, I want to get into it and, uh and read from the book of Acts 2 chapter I mean yeah book of Acts uh, chapter 2 verse 2 sorry about that um, and suddenly there came a sound from heaven as a as of a rushing mighty wind and it filled all the house where they were sitting so here we see you know the Holy Spirit being described as a, as a rushing mighty wind you know as it was coming in um, now remember this because this is uh very important you know from my own experience as well um you know in 2016 my life had you know i was just getting back on my feet and um you know i had been through a court case i was having trouble looking for jobs and it, not only that I, I was i was discouraged from looking for a job you know i had a i had a conviction on my record and i'm like who's gonna who's gonna hire me so i reached out to a friend of mine and um you know, he was hiring uh, for, um, you know, cable, pretty much to be a, a salesman. Um, it was door-to-door -door sales, and I was like, you know what, I give it a try and see, you know, see how it goes. So sure enough, yeah, I, I, I gave it a try, and I was like, okay, let, let's see, let's see where 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 I go with this, you know, and and where God leads me or whatever. So I took on the job, and um, as anyone knows that has worked on a door-to-door -door sales, it's it's very hard. It's not it's not an easy job. Uh, this job is definitely not easy it's um it's a job that you get a lot you get hundreds of no's before you even get a, a yes and uh, you know you have to be very courteous with the person you have to be respectful you you have to be very you know um, just honest with them at, you know as far as what you're trying to you know sell or, or whatnot um, and it's not easy but anyway on um, this specific day, I was um, walking down the street and I was, you know, 
knocking on doors and I was getting um I was getting several no's. I was getting several no's and I was getting discouraged, you know, and and I you know I was ungrateful for the job, you know. I I was I was ungrateful because I was discouraged. I'm like, how am I, you know, how did I end up here, you know, from, you know, being an insurance agent to, you know, being unemployed to, you know, pretty much relying on someone to say yes, you know, to get the cable service. That way I can get, you know, my, my pay. And, um, you know, it was a very humbling experience, you know, but, um, as, I, as I'm continuing, you know, to try to, you know, get somebody to, you know, purchase the, the, the service, I, um, I just kind of sit down. I'm exhausted. This is later towards the day, okay? I did start um, rather early, um, but this is later towards the day. And as I'm sitting there on the, on the curb, um, you know, I'm trying to read inspirational, um, you know, verses. I'm trying to get something you know to encourage me and um you know i i break down i'm not gonna lie i, I break down i break down in tears because i was overwhelmed i was stressed i you know the future seemed uncertain to me and um i try to motivate myself by looking up verses and you know trying to have faith and stuff and and yeah it, it was it i was just so overwhelmed by all of it you know and even thinking back to that day it just it, it was it was, you know for me it was it was terrible you know it, it it was not a good experience you know what i mean like i'm not knocking anyone's job you know this may be someone's job and stuff like this but um you know for me it it was difficult saying you know saying people getting telling me no pretty much and as i'm sitting there and as I mean, you know, I'm just kind of balled up like this in this position, just sitting on the curb. I, you know, I'm crying and, you know, I admit, I admit that I was crying and what I won't forget was that all of a sudden, um, I just feel like, like a wind, like a strong wind, literally in, in the middle of the street, you know, this, you know, daylight, I feel like a strong wind just come like, I can't even really describe it, but it, it just a strong wind, like just in the sense of the word, it was so strong that I'm not kidding you. Uh, there was cars parked on the other side of the street and um, it set off one of the car alarms. And uh, I remember it was like, it, the, the wind was enough to set off the car alarm. That's how strong it was. Okay, so when it set it off, I was just like, whoa, like, like what just happened, you know, and I, 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 something was telling me like that that wasn't just like your average wind. And as this car alarm is going off, um, I'm like, I start, you know, putting on my, my bag again and, you know, and I'm like, maybe, maybe it's a sign. I, I don't know. Maybe God is telling me, you know, try on this side of the street to, you know, try to get sales, you know, and sure enough, um, that side where the, where the car alarm was, you know, going off on, um, I, I walk over there and, and I'm, you know, going to the houses and knocking on doors to see if I can any any sales. And um, yeah, and I was just amazed. I was I was blown away because I believe I got, if I can remember correctly, I got two sales that day, and um, I got one for like the next day and so so total. Pretty much, I ended up getting about uh, three sales. And each cell pays quite a bit, so it, it is very re rewarding when you when you even get one cell. You know, it's it's very rewarding. And I was um, I was so happy, and I had just you know I had told my well, she, she was she was about to be my wife, but I had told her about this experience, and it's really hard to share this with someone because you know they they even though they might be believers they might just look at you and be like um yeah i mean you know or coincidence or whatever maybe no i thought how strong that wind was and i just know that god was just there with me as i'm in tears as i'm broken down and as i'm you know mind you my court things my court proceedings hadn't you know it wasn't 
so far in the you know in my past that it, it had just it had just been a few months that i've gone through all this and i lost my job and i went through all this and um you know like i said i was discouraged from applying to other jobs and um you know when i have had this when i had this experience and i know that it was that it was god and you know you know and just this powerful experience that you know um uh, however small it may seem to some for me it was it was huge it was it was definitely huge and um that's just uh one of my experiences um with the holy spirit and um yeah it made me you know take it take it to the lord and you know see if if he gives you an experience or may you may want to share down in the comments below um but yeah i i just wanted to share that with you guys and um just wanted to make some content um you know some from my experiences but uh thank you for watching